Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited that you decided to click on my video. In today's video, I am going to be tackling my dining area, kitchen area, and also my living room. My dining area isn't too bad as you can see, but I really did need to get a sweep done. And then later on, I'm also going to be mopping this area because my kids somehow got a ketchup stain on the floor over there by the wall. So I'm going to go ahead and mop that up. But if you are new to my channel and you are not currently subscribed to me, I would really appreciate if you will go ahead and consider hitting that red subscribe button along with the notification bell, especially if you enjoy my content, you guys. I would really, really appreciate that. And then while you're at it, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and feel free to leave me some comments down in the comment section because that really, really helps out my channel, y'all. So I will be very, very grateful if you guys can do that for me. So you guys, I have not uploaded a video in over three weeks and I have a reason for that. So for right now, I am going to let you guys get some cleaning motivation and then I will pop back on here and I will let you guys know why I haven't uploaded a video in over three weeks. This video is I think about 55, 56 minutes long. So go ahead, put me on your TV while you're getting some cleaning done and I will pop right back on here and we're gonna talk.
And guys, so in one of my previous videos, I mentioned that I didn't use our dishwasher. And it's because at that time, I didn't use it. My husband convinced me to just give the dishwasher a try. Like, I don't have anything against dishwashers. I just assumed that they would not get to my dishes as clean as I would like them. You know, so I just kind of like threw the dishwasher under the bus without even giving it a try. So one day I decided to give it a try and I filled it with, you know, plates, cups, glass jars. And shockingly, you guys, the very first load was great. Like the all of the dishes were clean. My forks, knives, spoon, all of my cutlery was clean. The glass jars were spotless, like didn't see anything on it not even the residue when you run water on it it was just like spotless clean so i was very very impressed so now i do use our dishwasher almost every day and i will have to admit it does help out and it has helped out a whole lot because i'm the type of person i just love to wash my dishes by hand but at times that can get very very time consuming especially if you have a, already have a lot of things on your list that you need to get done so i have started using the dishwasher and i am very happy with it now i will say that there are times when you know some of my dishes don't get as clean as i would like but what I do is I just go ahead and put them in the sink and I just wash them by hand. So overall, I would say that I am impressed. If I had to rate, if I had to rate my dishwasher on a scale of one to 10, I would give it a solid seven. Because at the end of the day, I still think that washing dishes by hand is the absolute best way, but a dishwasher is most definitely much more convenient. Also, let me know down in the comment section below, are you hashtag team dishwasher or do you prefer to wash your dishes by hand? I'm curious.
You've told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I. If you're gonna be moving on solo, wait a second, cause they're playing the best song. I'll be there if you reach out to me. So y'all, if y'all are wondering what I'm doing right here, I am actually blowing in the cracks because the cracks still has some soap sud. I wasn't able to just get in there with the towel. So I had to blow on it. That way it popped the soap suds out. So I know it looks weird, but cause I know y'all are probably like, what is she doing? So yeah, that's what I was doing y'all. So long, I've been trying to get you out of my head. Oh, yeah, but somehow I always seem to wake up in your bed. Mm -mm. Baby, if we talk for a minute, then maybe we'd be getting somewhere. Oh, uh -uh. I just want.
And guys, the reason why I am scrubbing this again is because I realized that I grabbed the wrong scrubber to begin with. I grabbed the softer one. This one right here uh, most definitely gets the job done. It's a little bit harder than the one that I was using at first. So I went ahead and re-scrubbed that so that I can get up the pieces that didn't come up at first. So guys, as you can see right here, I had a hard time getting these oven racks back in the oven. I don't know why, but every time I try to put these in, for some reason, I never am able to get them in. So I had to call my husband to the rescue and he showed me how to do it. So now I know exactly how to do it. So that way I won't have this issue in the future. We'll work it out, you'll see If we get in a car and drive someplace far Yeah, we could go for a ride The two of us, we don't have to stop Baby, let's go for a ride You and I, let us run away We can go where we want I'll have you Just living off the edge Only good times ahead So let me put a smile upon your face Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars I was down until you saved me, until you set me free My eyes were closed, now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say that you can take me high 
Feels like I can fly You can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow And I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed Now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly I don't need anybody, I don't need anybody else No one will ever take me, no one will ever take me away from you I promise I will hold on to you I don't know what I'd do without you Without you You can take me high Feels like I can fly You can take me high Feels like I can fly Can take me high Gonna stay in this moment Gonna lay here on the grass I don't need to feel lonely Okay, you guys, so now to tell you guys why I haven't posted in over three weeks. So, honestly, the reason why I haven't posted is because one day I was recording a video and once I got done with the little portion that I recorded, I looked over the video to see if maybe I needed to like do a different angle or, you know, just to just make sure that portion was what I wanted, right? And after looking at the video, or I guess I should say while looking at the video, I immediately got discouraged. And I got discouraged because I did not like the way I looked on camera. And to be completely honest with you, looking over this video, editing this video, I honestly don't like some of the angles in this video either. But I told myself that I am no longer going to not post content simply because I am struggling with, you know, how much weight that I've gained. And, you know, I know that I'm not the only person. So let me know in the comment section if you've gained a lot of weight and you're having a hard time, you know, just processing it. And you guys, I know that I don't like eat healthy every day or even majority of the time I don't eat healthy and I know that so I am 100% the reason why I've gained all of this weight so that's 100% my fault and sorry about this lighting right here you guys I don't know what happened in this specific clip I don't know why the lighting all of a sudden got dark but it's going to light up here soon. But yeah, you guys, um, as I was watching that video, I was just not happy because I noticed my double chin. I noticed just like how big my arms are, like my stomach. And I know guys, like I shouldn't do myself like that. And I'm well aware of that. But you know, sometimes it's hard. Like, so I would most definitely say that I am in the season of practicing self-love more because it is something that I am struggling with and I've been struggling with for the longest you guys it's just like 
you know when you have so much stuff that you have to do on a daily basis you know sometimes it just gets overwhelming like being a mom in general it gets extremely overwhelming and on top of that my husband and i we don't have support like when i say support like we literally don't have anyone it's just my husband myself and our two kids so you know sometimes I need a break, but unfortunately I can't get a break. And, you know, my comfort thing to do when I'm overwhelmed or with any emotion, my comfort thing is to eat. And I know that is not a good thing, you guys. I, I get it. I completely understand that that is a habit that I have to break and that is a habit that I am going to break. But I thought that I would share that with you guys because you know, I know that I'm not alone and I know that I will get over this. And, you know, at first I was just like, you know, not wanting to post it because I'm like, what if people see it who know me and they're going to be like, you know, look how big she's gotten. But you know what? I, I honestly don't care what no one has to say because I know that I am actively working on you know, becoming healthier. You know, I don't know how long it's going to take. Do I have a goal of when I would like to reach my desired weight goal? Yes. Will it happen during that time? I don't know. But as long as I know that I'm taking the steps, making progress each and every day, doing exactly what I'm supposed to do, then, you know, I know that I will eventually get there. So I just thought that I'd share that with you guys. Feel free to let me know down in the comment section if you've been struggling or not and if you have been struggling what have you been doing like on a daily basis to like lift yourself up you know because i know that it can be hard y'all like i know for a fact that it can be hard and on top of that i don't know if i've mentioned this before but i homeschool my kids and that right there is a job in itself you know so, yeah, I, you know, I just feel like I don't, I don't know, but I know y'all, I know y'all get exactly where I'm coming from. How you know you've been in love. T-shirts, so it smells like her perfume. Have you ever been in love? Have you ever lost your head? Have you felt like you were out of love breath when you saw her in that dress? When your heart is beating fast and you're sweating and you can't stop looking at her smile, then you've been in love. That's how you know you've been in love. And guys, I'm using my Swiffer Wet Jet, but going forward, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to be using my actual mop bucket because, I mean, the Swiffer is cool, and I think the Swiffer is kind of made for, like, if you spilled some juice on the floor or something, if you want to just quickly get it up. I think that that is what a Swiffer Wet Jet is for. I most definitely don't recommend mopping your entire floor with the Swiffer. Just use a mop, <laughs> in my opinion.
okay you guys so it is the next day i got tired last night after cleaning that kitchen so i was like you know what i'm just going to go ahead and finish up the living room tomorrow so right now i have a ton of books on the couch and i actually just recently ordered a bookshelf so i'm just waiting for that to make it here i ordered it from amazon but in the meantime, I'm just going to go ahead and put these books inside of the entertainment set just so that they have somewhere to be other than the couch. And then if you're wondering why I have all of these paper towels here, if you didn't know, you guys, I am a couponer. So I coupon every single week. And then I also have a couponing channel and it is called Saving with Shaniqua. I also have my channel linked in the description box below. So if you are interested in learning how to coupon, save some money, then go ahead and give my channel a check out. So right now, I'm just getting the books off of the couch and I'm going to go ahead and put them inside of the entertainment set. I'm not stacking them all nice and neat or anything i just want them in here up until i receive my bookshelf Did you ever stop and think why spend too much time just getting ready? Let me be honest. I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. When I see you, my heart starts racing. But I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na 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 na. Don't you see what's wrong with me? I need somebody to love. Oh, oh na na. I don't. Convince you to 
I did not realize that I had that much foam when I saw that I was like wow Ripped your heart, got a brand new one 
Since you got lost in November See it in your eyes when we leave for tonight Way too many heartbreaks still on your mind Let the flame burn down for a while Let the flame burn out for a while Stay in the moment Stay in the moment with me Give you a moment to Give you a moment with me Spend all the roses Spend all the roses with me trip on it when i got you can go slow wind it up on night baby take your time let me know Every moment tonight, they led me to you. Every single time you look at me, I lose it too. Why don't you come sit next to me? Let things happen naturally, like it used to be. So the end of the video is near you guys and I just wanted to come on here and thank you all once again for clicking on my video, watching my video, sharing my video, liking my video and also leaving me comments. 
I really, really appreciated you guys. I hope you got all of the cleaning motivation that you needed by watching my video so that you can get up and go ahead and tackle whatever it is that you need to do. My goal, you guys, is to put out two videos per week, minimum one, but I am most definitely going to work hard to get out at least two videos, you guys. I have to try to find some balance, but I most definitely will have content coming your way, you guys. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you have your, uh, make sure you're subscribed with the notification bell on. And until next time, guys, I hope that you enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.